Hey guys, I'm Beaver. This is Metal Gear Solid 5, The Phantom Pain. I've been after getting this game for a long time. I was trying to wait for it to come on sale for ages and it just wasn't. So I thought, sod it, I'm just going to buy it, see how it is. I've heard very good things about it, but I've also heard very bad things about it. From what I've heard, I have not played any of this, by the way. I've, I'm going to start this and you're going to see it at the same time as I do. But I've played all the Metal Gear Solid. Uh, games that have ever come out. I haven't completed one because I got stuck on it and got pissed off and decided to leave it. Two, I've completed way too many fucking times to remember. Uh, same with three and four. Uh, but from what I heard, from what well, from what I think, anyway, from what I've seen in the cutscenes and stuff, the like beginning cutscenes, this look like this looks like Metal Gear Peace Walker, but revamped. That's all it looks like to me. I might be completely wrong, but from what I've seen with the mother base and be it its big boss, I think it's just Peace Walker, but completely redone. But I mean, I quite liked Peace Walker, but once again, that's another one I didn't fully complete. So it's going to be interesting for me. So let's just get into it. And of course, I'm sorry if I don't speak that much in this one. Uh, of course, it's a very dialogue-heavy game. Uh, oh shit! There's a lot of story to go around it. Of course, if you haven't played any of the other ones, there's a lot that will go, that will go straight over your head. The Awakening, the prologue. Can you hear me? No. Are you having difficulty speaking? Yes. Can you move your head? No, I can't move my head. Not at all. Can't move my Just head. Nod no. If you can hear me. No. I refuse. Ah, God. Forced me. Look up, please. Whoop. <laughs> Hello, ceiling. Very good. How do you feel now? Can you speak? No. What is your name? When were you born? Can you recall? Okay. So, okay, uh, name. Sorry, I was gonna use that. Why? 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 Do it. No, oh, screw you. Birthday. Should I use my real birthday or just. Yeah, fuck it. Okay, there we go. Good. Checkpoint. Now then. Please try to relax. There is plenty of time. I need to tell you something. Please listen and try not to panic. Panic! Everyone fucking panic! You've been in a coma for quite some time. Yes, yes, I know. You would like to know how long. I'm afraid it's been nine years. Yes. Damn it! Nosokoma! 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 Yeah. Nurse! Calm down! Calm down! Try not to panic! Try not to panic! You'll be alright. Yeah, you just wake up from coma. Let's put him back to sleep. Jeez. How do you feel? Put him back to sleep for another whole week. Yeah, because that's not going to induce another coma. It's been one week since you came too. Now, let's try getting you out of that bed. Nurse. So nine years, my muscles were wasted away. And I'll Don't worry. 
weak as You've fuck. You've lost some strength, but we've been maintaining your muscle mass through massages, oh, yeah, CPM that that. therapy, and EMS. <laughs> just completely explained what I just said. Now, Thank you. I need to explain something to you, but you must be alive. Oh god, here we go again. Nine years ago, you were injured in an explosion. Upon examination, we discovered 108 foreign bodies embedded within you. In addition to shrapnel, we also found fragments of human bone and human teeth. Because I'm human, maybe. Most of it was removed, but some of the fragments still remain. They are located near your heart and in your skull. Look at this. The fragments are lodged deep within your cerebral cortex. We couldn't give you an MRI, the metal you see. But even if we were to extract it, you would most likely suffer a brain hemorrhage. Oh, wonderful. Mental and physical impairment are unavoidable. However, your current status is not life-threatening. Maybe this is continued after Peace Walker. I don't know. One more thing. This X-ray is on your upper body. You better look now. Best to understand your situation sooner than later. I know it's difficult, but please look down. It's best to see with your own eyes. Be brave. Here's my hand. His thumb's messed up. Oh, fucking hell. No, Sakoma! Grigor! Try to calm down! Calm down! Surely he would have noticed that. Calm down! That's not something that just, okay. that just goes unnoticed. Yes, yes. Calm down. Yes. Yes. And put me back to sleep. Best doctor, 10 out of 10. Two weeks, sir. Okay, put me to sleep for another week then. Can I just get out of this and just slaughter everyone now, please? It's true. There are those who wish you would never woken up. You should be dead, but you are not. The wheels are in motion. Your enemies are everywhere. We must alter your appearance immediately. Okay. Otherwise, I fear you won't leave this place alive. It's a wide open world up there, so there's something we need to take care of first. Am I going to be able to change my appearance? I'm going to change your appearance. We have no other choice. What you look like, however... I can change my appearance. That is weird as fuck. Hmm. Now what should I look like? Oh god no. I'm a little okay. Sorry. How much can you actually change? Jawline. Skin colour feature. Feature? I oh, know, I quite like I quite like it already, sort of thing. I'm not gonna mess this one up. I only do that on the second playthrough, like my Fallout video. I, I'm not messing this one up completely yet. Maybe on the second playthrough, I might record it just to see how messed up I can get them. I 
Do I even want anything on my face? Maybe not. There's nothing here that makes me go, oh, that's awesome. Okay, why not? I'll have something at least. No, yes. Okay, I might as well have something, I guess. Not, don't be boring, like. There we go. It's quite good, actually. It's quite a good feature for it. But at the same time, it's kind of Very ruins good. a bit of a Metal Gear Solid. Now, let's bit. remove this balance. So the whole point about this mm, was it was all just one long nicely. story of how everything tied to tell you into the each truth, other with very simple These bandages were more for your protection, to hide you from those who want you dead. As of today, your name is Ahab. Ahab? Forget everything. Dun dun your dun! Name, your past. Ha! <laughs> Don't even know. Don't even care. That's that is Peace Walker. This is you as you've lived until this day. Tomorrow, it becomes a phantom. I thought you just changed my appearance, what? She's not friendly. So my questions are, who did that? Where did they get the light from? This is a hospital with no fire alarms or something. Oh, okay. So with all the technology okay, of the Metal Gear Solid universe and all they can have as a prosthetic is that. What happened to the woman? 
A woman? I... We gave her a light. She took the short way down. Who are you? Who am I? You're talking to yourself. Been watching over you for nine years. You can call me Ishmael. Ishmael. What the hell is going on? Well, the good news is, you're in the land of the living. Bad news? A world wants you to <laughs> On your feet, soldier. The whole place is coming down. Need a little pick-me-up? Okay. Here. No. Nothing like a little digoxin to get you back in the game. Digoxin. Come on! So my face didn't change. Okay. Okay. That bad, is it? Drug's not working. We're getting out of here. Move it. <laughs> Don't even help. Thanks. That's going to matter in this condition. This way. Okay, now it's moving faster. Suddenly, something was there. What the hell is that? Psycho Mantis is freaky, cousin. Something's coming. That's right, fire used the elevator. Logic. No fire alarms whatsoever in this hospital or sprinklers or anything. Okay, I'll believe that. Rider showed up. <laughs> oh, that's loud. That's very loud. There's sprinklers to go up. Sprinklers, Ghost Rider's greatest weakness. Oh, 
just let me see if I can change this because it's really loud and I can't seem to. There's no just master volume setting or anything. It's really weird. So yeah, I'm, I'm sorry if you can't hear me that, that well. Like I said, it is a very dialogue heavy game and everything, so... Completely expendable. He's gonna die. Help me, please. Told you. So he's checking under the bed for us and not seeing us.
just grabbing and talking to someone else. Oh god, this game is horrible already. I mean, like, good horrible. Not bad horrible. They're not gonna help you. You're dead. What are you Is there no one here to help us? Like, at all? Really gave you a Don't you die chance. Me. Ahab. Let's try that again, shall we? I can't believe it's really weird how bloody start Don't get caught in those is um, cover. What? It's taken one. Don't you die on me. I'm covered by the Ahab. window. What? Ahab. Ahab! Ahab! Just call me Snake. Time to walk. Press the stance button to stand up. Don't get caught in those searchlights. So let's try again, but. Here they come, hurry. Okay, that's what you're supposed to do. Now! Also sprint, but still. As a surprise. Move, go. Focus on his ass.
So what am I supposed to be doing right now? Am I just waiting for him or? should see him so easily. Game logic, right there. Okay. Huh. They're shooting all the fucking bodies, so that's going to that plan's gonna work well. Okay, just stop at us. Yeah, no, it's fine. Don't do it to all of them. Just, oh no, these two, these two are fine. That's yes, fine. They have no blood on them. They're, they're fine. Remove your head. Oh.
on that day there was no shits given. I want his gun. You see, according to every Metal Gear... I know how to shoot the gun. Hold Wait, down what? the aim button to aim. Then press the attack button to fire. Okay. As I was saying, yeah, according to every every other Metal Gear that has ever existed, I'll take the SMG, thank you. B, which one's B? Uh, yeah, basically, according to every other Metal Gear, uh, apart from three, actually, 
you can't use anyone else's weapon because it's ID locked. So it's, it just seems really weird that you can just casually pick up their weapons and use them. This is the Metal Gear universe. It seems to change constantly at the moment. I get shipment in the back of the head. Oh, he's over Psychomantis. What did I say? Well, it's not actually Psychomantis, but it's something like Psychomantis. You do seem to want to be killing the enemy more than me. I don't, I mean, there's no way they're friendly to me, but they seem to be more than me to kill everyone else. Let's try this back. How is it me? Does it look um, a lot like Vulcan from 3? Unless that was actually the whole point, because if it is, plot twist!
I stop you? Checkpoint.
Checkpoint! There we go. This seems like good as good a place as any to, uh, to stop it for now. Anyway, that was Metal Gear Solid 5. I'll probably do some more on it because I am. I'm actually loving this game already at the moment. Uh, then again, I'm just a little, a little bit of a fanboy when it comes to any Metal Gear Solid, uh, Metal Gear Solid things. I absolutely love the whole universe of it, the whole fandom of it, everything to do with it. So, anyway, I'm going to leave this video here. I've been recording for a while now, and I've got stuff to do anyway. So, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you later.